is Trivia for Kids, where it's not just for adults anymore. Welcome to this week's episode of Trivia for Kids. We are so excited for you to join us. Hey, it's your girl, Quinn. And your dad, Dan. So, what are some of the categories we're going to do this week? I see what you did there. Cat, agori, what are they? We have a dog category. We have a cat category. We have a Harry Potter category. We have a Disney sing-along category. And we have a tree category. So, I hope you all are entertained from our categories of many sorts. Uh, But before we get started, therefore, we should... Talk about our cat. Uh, okay. So we have a cat, and what's her name? Clover. And what does Clover like to do? Sleep. She does. We like her most of the time, right? Yeah, she likes to bite. She does like to bite every once in a while. She's real friendly like that. <laughs> and now, time for our serenade! Without further ado, we should get to the joke of the week. Why was the broom always late for school? It overswept. Ha ha ha. Everybody loves a good, clean broom joke. Ha 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 ha. Here comes the categories. Here's how the show works. Trivia for Kids consists of five rounds with seven questions each. We will announce the answers at the end of each round. Each new round will have a different category. After the fifth round, we will have the final exam, which will test you on the toughest questions we have covered in the previous rounds. Everyone ready? Let's get started. Round one. The category is tree. Question one. What type of tree produces acorns? Question two. What season do trees' leaves turn from green to orange or red? Question three. Which of the following fruit grows on a tree? Blueberry, melons, oranges, or grapes? Question four. What part of the tree grows under the ground? Question five. What is the wood on the outside of the trunk known as? Question six. What are trees called that keep their green leaves all year round? Question seven. If you cut a slice out of a tree, you can see rings. What do these rings tell us? These are the answers to round one. Question one. What type of tree produces acorns? The oak tree. Question two. What season do trees' leaves turn from green to orange and red? Fall or autumn. Which one do you like to use, fall or autumn? Fall. I agree. Question three. Which of the following fruit grows on a tree? Blueberry, melons, oranges, or grapes? Oranges. Do you know what they call the other ones? Like what a blueberry grows on? Bush. Correct. How about a grape? Vineyard. A vine. Yep, you had it You had it most of the way right. Question four. What part of the tree grows under the ground? The root. Or is it the root? The root. Root, root. Same thing. Potato, patata. Correct. Question five. What is the wood on the outside of the trunk known as? Bark. That was good. Well said. Question six. What are trees called that keep their green leaves all year round? Evergreen trees, they normally have snow on them, which is why they're kind of known as the Christmas tree, because they never really 
The leaves never fall off. Good explanation. Question seven. If you cut a slice out of a tree, you can see rings. What do these rings tell us? How old a tree is. It also tells us what the weather was like during each year of a tree's life. Round two. The category is Harry Potter. Question one. What is the name of he who shall not be named? Question two. What was the name of the first novel of the series? Question three. Who was the headmaster of Hogwarts? Question four. What role did Harry play on the Gryffindor Quidditch team? Question five. What are Harry's two best friends' names? Question six. What type of animal did Hagrid gift Harry? And question seven. On which platform is the Hogwarts Express? Round two, answers. Question one, what is the name of he who shall not be named? Voldemort. Daniel. Question two, what was the name of the first novel of the series? Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Question three, who is the headmaster of Hogwarts? Dumbledore. Dumbledore. Question four, what role did Harry play on the Gryffindor Quidditch team? Quarterback. No. Seeker. Seeker. Question five, what are Harry's two best friends names? Ron and Hermione. And Draco. Have you ever met anybody named Hermione before? Probably not. I haven't either. I wonder if that's a, a common name in England. Mm hmm. Question six. What type of animal did Hagrid gift Harry? An owl. Do you remember what the owl's name was? Hedwig. Question seven. On which platform is the Hogwarts Express? Nine and three quarters. Round three, the category is cats. Question one, true or false, the average cat can spend two thirds of its life sleeping. Question two, which part of a cat's body can appear and disappear? Question three, which part of a cat is as unique as a human fingerprint? Question four. What is the name of the orange-striped, lasagna-loving cartoon cat? Question five. All kittens are born with what color eyes? Question six. What is a male cat called? Question seven. What is the name of the swashbuckling cat who wears a hat and fights with a sword in the Shrek movies? Here are the answers to round three. The category is cats. Question one, true or false? The average cat can spend two thirds of its life sleeping. It's true. A cat can sleep 12 hours a day or more. That's kind of like koalas. Koalas spend a lot of their days in sleeping. Does our cat sleep that much? No. Question two. Which part of a cat's body can appear and disappear? It's claws. Cats have retractable claws. Their sharp nails come out when they climb trees or catch prey, and then they retract them back into their toes. That's pretty interesting. Mm-hmm. Question three, which part of a cat is as unique as a human fingerprint? Nose. A cat's nose has a unique pattern of ridges on it, just like your fingertips. So you suppose if a cat goes to jail, they do nose prints instead of fingerprints? 
Probably. Question four. What is the name of the orange striped lasagna loving cartoon cat? Garfield. Do you know what who Garfield's nemesis is? Odie? Nope. Nermal. I don't know Nermal. Nermal's another cat that Garfield is always arguing and fighting with. Question five. All kittens are born with what color eyes? Blue. What color are your eyes? Brown. Mine too. Question six. What is a male cat called? A tom. A female cat is called a queen. Question seven. What is the name of the swashbuckling cat who wears a hat and fights with a sword in the Shrek movies? Boots and boots. Round four. The category is finish the lyric of the Disney song. Question one. Oh, I just can't wait to be blank. Question two. What can I say except blank? Question three. And you don't know why, but you're dying to try. You want a blank. Question four. The snow glows white on the mountain tonight, not a blank. Question five. A spoonful of sugar helps blank. Question six. You never had a friend like blank. Question seven. Hi ho, hi ho, it's blank. And now the answers to round four. Question one. Oh, I just can't wait to be blank. King. From the, the Lion, Lion King. King. Question two. What can I say except blank? You're welcome. From Moana. Moana. Question three. And you don't know why, but you're dying to try. You want a blank. Kiss the girl. From The Little, the Little Mermaid. Mermaid. Question four. The snow glows white on the mountain tonight, not a blank. Footprint to be seen. From Frozen. Frozen. Question five. A spoonful of sugar helps blank. The medicine go down. From Mary, Mary Poppins. Poppins. Question six. You ain't never had a friend like blank. Me. From Aladdin. Aladdin. Question seven. Hi ho, hi ho, it's blank. Off to work we go. From Snow, Snow White. White. Round five. The category is dogs. Question one. Which dog breed is known to pull sleds? Question two. How many Dalmatians were there in the Disney film? Question three. What is the smallest breed of dog? Question four. In the Beethoven movies, what breed of dog is Beethoven? Question five. Which dog breed can run the fastest? Question six. Dogs have a better sense of smell than humans. How many times better? 100 times better? 1,000 times better, or 100,000 times better. Question seven. True or false, Dalmatians are born with spots. Here are the answers to round five. Question one. Which dog breed is known to pull sleds? The Husky. Correct. Question two. How many Dalmatians were there in the Disney film? 101. How do you think they came up with that number? It's a very random number. I mean, it's only one over a very particular number. Maybe that's what they thought too. Question three. 
What is the smallest breed of dog? The Chihuahua. I Chihuahua. Some people thought it might be the teacup of different varieties of dogs, but that's just a different variety within the breed, not a breed in itself. Question four. In the Beethoven movies, what breed of dog is Beethoven? St. Bernard. Question five. Which dog breed can run the fastest? The Greyhound. That is why Greyhounds were the most popular dogs in dog racing, which is now illegal in most states. So do you know that there's a whole bus line named after Greyhounds called Greyhound Buses? Really? Greyhounds can also jump fridges. It's a random fact. I like it. Question six. Dogs have a better sense of smell than humans. How many times better? 100 times better? 1,000 times better? Or 100,000 times better? 100,000 times better. Holy moly, that's a lot of sense. It's hard to imagine being 100,000 times better than our senses. It would be like being a mile away and smelling a pizza parlor. Question seven. True or false? Dalmatians are born with their spots. False. Puppies are born white and their spots come in later. It's a good thing they didn't name the movie 101 White Puppies That Get Spots Later. <laughs> And now the questions for the final exam. Now, remember, you've already heard these questions in this episode, but these are the hardest ones we had. So use your memory and try to think back to what the answers were. Question one, what type of tree produces acorns? The oak tree. Question two, which dog breed can run the fastest? The Greyhound, which are used for racing, but is now illegal in many states. Question three. On which platform is the Hogwarts Express? Nine and three quarters. Question four. What are trees called that keep their green leaves all year round? Evergreen trees. Question five. What is a male cat called? A Tom. Do you remember what the female cat is called? A queen. Question six. What is the smallest breed of dogs? The Chihuahua, which honestly to me sounds like a topping for a hot dog. Hmm. Question seven. Which part of a cat is as unique as a human fingerprint? The nose. So that wraps up episode number six. I had a blast going through all these questions with you, Quinn. Me too. Thank you guys for listening. Until next time, have a great day. Adios. Please follow us on Facebook and Instagram at Trivia for Kids Podcast. And if you have any ideas for questions or even an entire category, email us at Trivia for Kids Podcast at gmail.com.